Uh, hey guys, as you can tell, I have the new iPhone 4. And I've only had this phone for a couple days. As you can tell, it actually still has the, the protective film on the front and the back. So, I've only had it just for only for a little while. And I have a pretty unique problem. Even though this has been going on uh, to other users of this phone, um, I've only seen it discussed in uh, forum discussions and like Apple's um, discussion board. And well, the problem is these uh, the microphones, like the uh, the nose can uh, sorry the nose canceling microphone at the top is either the problem or the mic at the bottom. And what the issue is, is when you're making a phone call and you decide to use the speakerphone option, uh, the person on the other line cannot hear you. Um, either they cannot hear you at all, or it's extremely hard to hear, um, like as if you're um, in a windy, um, like if you're outside and it's extremely windy. And this also happens um, when you're taking video as well. So I, um, well, the purpose of this video is basically to replicate this problem so that all can see what really, what this issue really is. And I'm actually surprised that this hasn't really been brought up to Apple, at least to my knowledge, because everyone's, um, going absolutely nuts over the whole antenna issue and uh, the dropping bars and reception. So I am actually kind of honored to be probably the first person that is going to post a video um, about this. So alright, so let's get started and let's replicate it. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take a video and while I'm taking this video, <clears throat> I am going to be talking um, just to show that the um, mic is not picking up my voice. And as you can tell, well, the switch for the ringer is on. It is on. See, vibrate. Ringer switch is on. And the volume is all the way up and yeah so okay let's try it out so here I go it's in video mode as you can tell and now I'm gonna press record and then I'm just gonna be talking just just because <laughs> so alright so now it's recording and yeah, it is taking video, so that's normal, but it's not going to pick up any sound. Instead, it's going to have a loud, windy, whooshing sound. That's pretty much the best way I can explain it. So, let's stop it, and now I'm going to play this video. And as you can tell, when I was taking the video, I was not covering up any of the microphones I was holding it like this so now when I play this video you're gonna hear that windy whooshing sound instead of my voice so here it goes and as you remember I was talking while this video was being captured And so, yeah, nothing. All right, so that's one main problem. I mean, well, how, how <laughs> that is the problem. Now, this is what's kind of interesting. So it doesn't work during speakerphone. Um, I'm not going to really replicate that just because it's, it's kind of late, late right now. But it 
it's, it does a, almost the exact same thing as um, when you're taking video. But this is the interesting part. When you're doing a like a voice memo, uh, it actually picks up your voice just fine. So I don't know if it's a software issue or um, the mic issue. I think it's the mic because as far as I know that microphone is what's used when you're using speakerphone but when you're taking video I think this microphone along with this whoops this microphone is being used when you're taking video because since this is the noise cancelling microphone um, this mic is supposed to pick up the main um, source of audio while this one is canceling out canceling out the background noise so with this app well the voice memos it mainly uses this microphone so by testing this this proves that this microphone does work it's this one that doesn't so see watch hey how you doing whoop sorry All right. Hey, how you doing? Let's see. Hey, how you doing? Works just fine. So, yeah. So anybody who actually has a similar issue, definitely leave a comment down below. Um, or if anybody actually even knows how to resolve the issue, definitely leave a comment also. Or or private message me, PM me. Um, I'm trying to avoid going to Apple just because I actually live in a pretty small town and the closest Apple store is like 150 miles away. So I'm trying to figure out if this is a software problem and it may get fixed during the next update. Who knows? Probably not just because since this is kind of a fresh new problem every Apple's trying to fix the whole antenna issue even though we all know <laughs> it's not a software issue it's the stupid antenna that's the problem <laughs> so um so yeah definitely leave a comment so all right thanks for watching and hopefully this brings any help to anybody all right Thanks. See ya.